Hey, this is Chad with Monday Scientific. Today we're going to do some disassembly on this Olympus SEX10. The scope just uh, just sold, and we're going to help the help the customer take it apart and put it back together. It'll be completely disassembled for safety whenever we ship it out. So um, I got my tools here that we need, and uh, we're going to start off with the three millimeter Allen wrench. We'll include a few of these tools in the box for the customer in case they don't have them. So first things first. Uh, the microscope, we're testing it, so we're going to make sure it's off and unplugged. Okay, and then we're going to do um, the head. We're going to take the head off. It's going to be right here in between the binocular body, three millimeter Allen wrench, and that's going to come off. Okay, we're going to set that to the side just for right now, and then we're going to move on to the next part. Um, your lamp house on the back here just to show you you can pull that out It's a 6 volt 30 watt bulb if you ever need to change the bulb on this base It's got a nice handle or if you have to move it around the lab and then here this particular SEX has a dual um, Nose piece on it, so you can have two objectives on it so the reason I show you that is because we have to take the whole assembly off and then we're gonna have to remove this lens these two lenses to get the scope the scope portion off the focus mount it slides off on the dovetail and we're gonna show you how to do that right now so this right here you're gonna loosen and the whole assembly comes off and we're gonna set it off here to the side very gently and we're gonna move the stand out of the way just for the purpose of the video. And we're gonna move this back in. So the lenses, we have a analyzer on this particular model. It comes off with a knurled screw. We're gonna take that off. We're gonna remove each objective. Once both objectives have been removed, you can turn this right here off center. And with a 2.5 millimeter Allen wrench, you can loosen and take out each one of these screws. There's gonna be three of them. And then see how we can't see the third screw? You're gonna to have to rotate it back to get to it. Rotate the turret back. To get access. Once you do that, the whole assembly comes off. You're going to use a four millimeter Allen wrench right here. Sometimes there'll be a white cap over this screw. It's going to be on the right side of the focus mount. We had it off for the demonstration. But once you loosen that, this whole microscope comes apart. So once that's apart, you're kind of done taking the microscope apart. You do everything in the reverse to put it back together. I'm gonna to get the stand again. All right, now that we have the stand, we're gonna have a glass plate. Here is your polarizer. So the polarizer's gonna be underneath the glass plate and you're gonna rotate the analyzer to cross the poles and achieve polarization. If you do need to take this column out, this is going to be a three millimeter Allen wrench, or excuse me, four millimeter Allen wrench. Loosen both of these and the column comes out. Uh, th this column right here, you can get a wide variety of um, links and then that, you know, depending on how much working distance you need. Also, a lot of these columns at the top, you can put the three millimeter Allen wrench in there. So uh, we'll put that in there for this particular customer. So we'll leave it all out. So that's how you're gonna disassemble this Olympus SEX-10. To put it back together, you would just do the steps in reverse. And if you have any questions, as always, you can email us at info at mondaymicroscope.com or you can call us at 919-775-5596. Thank you.